Good news, Commander. Just before we escaped Iacath, Scorpio sent technical readouts to us. We're using them to enhance the gravestone. It's a farewell gift. The ship will remain dry docked until the upgrades are complete. It'll be some time before it's ready for action. Our scout reports Iacath's radiation levels are still dangerously high. They disrupt navigation, at comm signals. We can't get close enough to explore. And we've seen nothing of Scorpio, assuming she did merge with Iacath. We've barely scratched the surface of that world. Alert me the moment it's safe to return. You'll be the first to know. There has been no change in Senya's condition. The doctors have done all they can. The rest is up to her. What have we learned about Arkin? My agents followed his trail from Tython to Dantuim, but it went cold after Nashadar. Alliance intelligence won't stop hunting Arkin. We will find him. I've been meaning to ask. How did you defeat Valen aboard the Gravestone? I didn't. Valkorion triggered conditioning buried deep in Valen's mind. She wanted to strike me down, but she couldn't. I see. That must be agonizing for Valen. But it's good news for the Alliance. Despite all we've endured, we're stronger than ever. Do not surrender to self-delusion. If not for my conditioning, Valen would rain death upon this world. You are strong, but you are never safe. I need a fleet that obeys my commands without question. Give it to me. Connecting to Gemini Frequency. Resetting all units to default programming. Reset complete. Awaiting input. Vessel 9947. Destroy Vessel 3265. is so much better when we know our place. We've got bad news. Six Alliance patrols, four outposts, one supply convoy from the Sith Empire. All destroyed by the Eternal Fleet in the last hour. There can only be one reason. Valen's regained control of the Gemini droids. Then we take the fight to Valen. Remove her from power before she tears the galaxy apart. We can't simply launch an attack on the heart of the Empire. I found someone who can help. An inside man on Zakul. I saw the fleet hull of it. Ghastly business. I apologize on behalf of my people. And you are? Indo's arm. Magistrate of revelry and attendant to Empress Valen. She's a plague on the good people of Zakul. But if we work together, we can remove her from power and end this blasted war. Double-crossing Valen is no small risk. We'll make sure you're protected. Esne's eyes. You're as noble as they say. Have we confirmed this isn't a trap? Don't worry. Mendo's clean. But eager to get my hands dirty, Valen is throwing a party on Zakul to celebrate her glory. The guest list is exclusive. But I'll secure invitations, disguises, everything you need to infiltrate the party and overthrow the Empress. Valen can sense my presence. We'll need a distraction if we want to get close. Distractions are my specialty, and your party crash is my magnum opus. Even if we avoid detection, we'd need an army to penetrate her defenses. And an army you'll have. During the party, Valen plans to execute my dear friends, a host of Zakulin rebels. 
Save the rebels, and they will help dethrone the Empress. An enemy of Valin is a friend of mine. I'll do whatever I can to ensure their safety. I knew I was right to cast my lot with you. This could work. T7 and I can slice into the security grid. And I'll help you get close enough to trigger Valen's conditioning. How exciting! I take it Operation Dragon's Maw is a go. Tell me that's not really the name of the mission. Never do anything unless you do it in style. Let's liberate an empire, shall we? Everyone gear up. In one hour, we infiltrate the cool and crash Valen's party. is set for my daughter's ruin. Strike her down, and this empire will be yours to command. When I take the throne, how long before you call for my destruction? If I wanted you destroyed, I would have done it long ago. My fate is tied to yours. We're approved for landing. Endo really pulled through with our disguises. Let's suit up before we make landfall. Kneel before the dragon of Zakul. Excellent form. If you want something, spit it out. Your guests are arriving. They toast your name and hungrily await your speech. And the rebels. Adorned with shock collars as you requested. The party must be perfect. If you disappoint me... I'll watch you sizzle. see a thing in this blasted disguise. How do we look? If I didn't know better, I'd think you were the night captain. I'll take that as a compliment. Let's find Endo. We're plugged into spa security, ready to assist. My favorite knights. Welcome to the grand festival of Empress Valen. We must be careful. The Hullinet drones are broadcasting this party for all the galaxy to see. We could use this to our advantage. The more viewers we have, the more support the Alliance gains. Interplanetary celebrity status is great for funding. But first, we must free the rebels. Removing those shock collars won't be easy. You have any tricks up your sleeve? That I do. Party favors? Ion charges to attach to the security relays. Trigger them during Valen's big speech. The blast will disable the collars, leaving my compatriots free to join your attack. Tell the rebels to keep away from the Horizon Guards. I'll handle the elite forces myself. Right. Avoid the scary ones with lightsabers. I'll keep the party going while you set the charges. 
But once the task is done, we'll show the Empress what we're made of. We have had a breakthrough. I remember the last idiot who made that kind of promise. I'm still finding bits of him in my hair. I am confident in the results. You will soon be freed from your weakness. Prepare for my arrival. Oh, but first, I have traitors to kill. Said. We're almost there. Valen's beginning her speech. Ahead of schedule. to destroy me, but I ground them to dust. Now the Outlander hides in fear as my fleet rips through the galaxy. I am the wrath of the dragon's fire. I am your eternal empress. <laughs> I think it's time for a guest appearance, don't you? Can't wait to see the look on her face. Let's ditch the armor. Give a speech to Crash. Today we celebrate the Eternal Empire's strength and watch our enemies suffer. The rebels who spit on Isaacs and the worm who betrayed me. They deserve an eternity of torment and no one, not even the Outlander, can save them. You really need better security. <laughs> so you're Indo's puppet master? Or is Father controlling you both? You're the only one under Valkorian's spell. Does the public know about your conditioning? for the dragon of Zakul. Ah! Smile for the cameras. A cool. You can't win, Outlander. Your own people have joined the Alliance. 
I'd say you already lost. After I kill you, I'll mount Indo's head on the throne room wall. Commander, look out! Take my sister alive. news we found Arkan I'll be sure to tell him he has terrible timing then we better get moving Tonight got a bit too exciting for my tastes. I suppose I have Arkan's grand entrance to thank for that. Forget Arkan. We came here for Valin, and I'm not letting her escape. I suspect Big Brother's got the same idea. about the disease father planted in my brain. He made weapons of us both. Let me help you break free. I don't need your help. Contusions aside, the rebels stand ready to fight. What are your orders? Round up any survivors. Get everyone you can away from the action. You can count on us. Great Isaacs. Is this what being a hero feels like? You heard the Outlander. For the cool! We've got a lock on Valen and Arkin. Head for the sky deck. Commander, we've cracked the intel you secured earlier. Stand by while I open a shortcut. Father wants a word with you. we both saw the opportunity to confront my sister. I hardly recognize you without the mask. The new look suits you. It marks a new beginning. Even if he's changed, can we really trust him? He hasn't exactly proven himself. 
I stand corrected. Traitors to the throne! Prepare to fall! If Valen wants to challenge us, we'll meet her. Together. Let's show the Empress who she's dealing with. I stand with you, Outlander. My father was right to recognize your strength. But are you in control? Or does he pull the strings? Falkorian may have forced his way into my head, but my choices are my own. That resolve may be what Zakul needs. You would stand aside as an outsider seizes your throne? Father, you've grown weak. My hands are stained with the blood of millions. This family's legacy is dripping with it. It's time a worthy Emperor takes our place. It's not too late, Arkan. You can still redeem yourself. I'm beyond redemption. I can't change the past, but I can atone for it. Your destiny is to lead Zakul. And mine is to join the Alliance. I did not raise my son to serve. You have no son. The galaxy is watching, Commander. Now's your chance to make an impact. Zakul, I come to you not as a conqueror, but as an ally. Together, we can end this war and bring peace to the galaxy. The Alliance welcomes all who want to stand and fight for freedom. Today, we're proud to count your former Emperor among us. My strength is yours, Commander. Bombard them! Don't stop until the Outlanders melted to slag! But your supporters... Kill them all! Now! I can't get to you. It's chaos. Head back to the landing pad. I'm as surprised as you, buddy. Save the greetings. Let's get out of here alive. Mission accomplished. Sort of. Valen survived, but she's hated by half of Zakul. And Endo escaped with the rebels. They even gained a few recruits from the civilians they rescued. 
More importantly, the former Emperor now works for us. I sensed a change in him. But are we sure we can trust the man who tried to kill you, multiple times? Don't forget freezing you in carbonite for five years. Revenge consumed me for too long, but you saved my mother, and for that, I'm in your debt. Senya believed in your ability to change, and she was right. She was right about you as well. I finally see it, but your work is not complete. My sister's reign of destruction is far from over. You know her better than anyone. What's her next move? The power you hold over her conditioning, she won't allow it to continue, like any cornered predator. She will strike back. We are ready for your arrival. Father's leash has choked me long enough. It's time I break free. You should have left me, Anathema. You are my daughter. This is where you belong. what they did to me there. You needed discipline. You had to learn to control your power. <gasps> the bond between us is growing stronger. You are glimpsing my memories. Valin mentioned Nathema. What is that? Nathema is a blighted, forgotten world where the Force has been corrupted. I sent Valen there to condition her mind and teach her obedience. No wonder your daughter hates you and everyone else. She learned to hate long before I sent her away. Unchecked, Valen was a threat to everything I had created, and to herself. Her power had to be contained. If she was such a threat, you should have just killed her. She was still my daughter. In her, I saw aspects of myself. I hoped she could become worthy of the throne. She failed me. Instead of focusing on the mistakes of my past, you should ask what this vision means for our future. Are you saying Valen went back to Nathema? She would only return if she had found a way to break her conditioning. If Valen unleashes her full power, even you may not be strong enough to stop her. Still no word on where Valen's disappeared to. Any chance she decided to give up on Galacta Conquest and retire to a quiet little colony on the Outer Rim? That is not my sister's style. I might know where she's gone. A planet called Nathema. I never thought to hear the name of that accursed world again. You've been there? Once. 
It's where Valkorin locked my sister away when she was a child. It's in the Corlean sector. Hang on. Someone sent an encrypted holocall to Valen during her little party. We traced the origin to that sector. The message was important enough for Valen to drop everything and go. Nathema is a tainted world. If I go there, I fall back into my old ways. Everything I have accomplished since being healed on Voss will be undone. I believe you're strong enough to do this, but I won't force you to go. Thank you. I will stay and watch over Senya in case she wakes. I'll go prep the shuttle. Scans detect only one structure emitting signs of life. This world is unnatural. Like the Force is hollow. I felt it too. The Force flows through every living thing, Theron. Even you. The Emperor corrupted the Force on Zyost and drove everyone mad with bloodlust. But here, I barely sense the Force at all. The effects will be stronger on the surface. The absence of the Force could drive us mad. My power is limited here, but I will do what I can to shield you and your companions from the worst effects of the Void. Taking us down. Greetings, Empress. It has been far too long. Where is Jarek? Waiting for you in his lab. Do you remember the way? Wait here. I'll keep an eye on the shuttle. Call if you need me. It's worse here. The void. It's hunger. It wants to devour me, mind and spirit. Annihilate every trace of my existence. I'll be at your side every step of the way. Together, we can face anything. Out of anyone else's mouth, that would sound like a lie. The void's draw is powerful, but it will also hide us from Valen's awareness. Let's see if we can get these doors open.
were not armed with such a weapon as a child. <laughs> I fear none of my pets would have survived. Why did your beast attack me, Jarek? I am the Empress now, not a prisoner. They respond to fear and hate. If you could learn to control your emotions, like your father, they would not trouble you. I am not like Valkorian! You told me you'd made a breakthrough. Everything is prepared, Empress, in the main lab. Okay, I'm ready for anything. The beasts ripped a young man apart. He died screaming in front of Valen, but she made no move to help. Things are progressing well. With all the experiments they did on her, I'm surprised she would ever set foot on Nathema again. I imagine she would do anything to break free from Valkorian's mental conditioning. Sith. Jedi. I can still feel the suffering of their final moments. Valen will go to any length to break her conditioning. Can she actually undo what you did to her? In theory, it is possible. In practice, even she may not be strong enough to survive the process. If this doesn't work... If you are strong enough to survive the process, your bonds will be broken. Have any of your lab rats survived so far? None were as strong as you. Is something wrong, Empress? No. Let's begin. Running out of time. Come on. Wait! I am not your enemy. I recognize you from the Holos. You're the one in charge of this place. I am Jarek, a humble servant of the Eternal Throne who merely does what he is told. A justification for evil I've heard far too often. The pursuit of scientific knowledge is not evil, though there are sometimes unforeseen consequences. Valen, something went wrong. Her power is racing out of control. When it erupts, the entire asylum will be destroyed. Survive this, 
cataclysm, but we need to work together. This partnership's over the second you make a wrong move. Your terms are agreeable. Valen's power has driven the Keepers and Beasts mad. I can guide you to safety, but you must protect me along the way. Hurry and stay close. It isn't far. What is this place? The Immortal Emperor's Vault. Inside, Valkorion stored artifacts even he feared were too powerful and dangerous to use. I cannot protect you from what lies inside. Sounds like you don't want me learning your secrets. All the more reason to enter. I can't hear you. You're fading. Was that Valkorion? Ever since we arrived, he's been acting strangely. The Void could be affecting him. Or there could be more to Nathema than he's told us. The power surge overloaded the circuits. We're trapped. This vault has to have some kind of backup system to restore power. There is. You must reactivate the power generator. But do be careful. Valkorion sealed deadly guardians in here to protect his treasures. After centuries of hibernation, I suspect they will be hungry. Nothing's ever easy, is it? Talking about Valkorion. Valkorion, Tenebrae, Vitiate, Emperor of the Sith. My low born son has worn many masks. I am Lord Dramath. A thousand years ago, I ruled this planet when it was a vibrant world named Madrias. I never thought of Valkorion as having a father. One of many offspring I sired. He was the least of my children. His mother, a nameless peasant. 
But he murdered me, imprisoned my spirit, and turned Madrias into this. You said this was once a lush and vibrant world. What happened? He lured many Sith Lords here before consuming them in a dark ritual that wiped out all life on the planet. He did something similar on Zyost. His hunger for immortality must constantly be fed. Why didn't he consume your spirit? For a thousand years he has taunted and tortured me. But now, salvation is at hand. This Holocron has the power to destroy what remains of my essence. Grant me the release of Oblivion. Are you sure? Just end it all. I seek an end to my suffering and revenge against Tenebrae. Through you, I can have both. This Holocron is not just my prison. It can destroy him once and for all. Every time Valkorion gets taken down, he pops up again in some other form. He is immortal, but not invulnerable. This Holocron is the instrument of his destruction. There will come a moment when Tenebrae is vulnerable. That is when you must strike. Until then, release me from my prison. Keep the Holocron close and bide your time. You know things about Valkorion that could be useful. Maybe we should keep you around for a while. I have given you the key to end my son's existence. There is no purpose to keeping me alive. Valkorion has many victims, but none who have suffered for as long as you. I will set you free. And so... It ends. I hope we don't regret that. Hold on to the Holocron for now. Valkorion can't know we have it. I've got a bad feeling about this. Jarek didn't make it. Pity. At least he was right about our escape route. Did you find what you were looking for, Empress? You tell me. <laughs> I have never seen such power. I am no longer chained. And what of your former prison? ships to leave orbit. Soon, there will be nothing left on Nathema but dust and ash. You need to hold jets, Commander. Power reading spiking. The whole place is about to blow. I'll pick you up outside.
Get in! You do love to cut it close, don't you? Valen has broken her bonds. Now, she will be stronger than ever. Stopping time again. You're back to your old tricks. My power has returned now that Nathema has been left behind. Did you discover anything significant inside my vault? Are you scared? You should be. Your mind games are nothing to me, Outlander. But do not lose focus on what matters. Valen must be stopped. That's only step one. Step two is getting you out of my head. Be careful what you wish for, lest you get it. Valen's long gone. What happened down there? The Empress broke free from her conditioning. Now she's more dangerous than ever. Then we must act quickly. What is our next move, Commander? We can figure out a strategy once we're back on Odessan. Wouldn't mind a bit of R&R &R first. Or at least a nice long nap in my own bed. Setting a course for... Huh. Call coming in. Commander, do you copy? Odessan is under attack. 